There is a serious problem, a pandemic in London. And no, it's not swine flu, it's not meningitis, it's not the chicken pox, it's something worse. It's something deadly, it's something terrifyingly toxic. The thought of it keeps me awake in the night, shivering. Pigeons, pigeons, pigeons. There's a pandemic of pigeons sweeping through our streets. They've invaded and they're multiplying. They're ready to make our walk from A to B a living hell with their filthy feathers and sharp, unblinking eyes. They're ready and poised to strike with their bombs of poo and their disease. I want them off our streets, those brazen vermin. Is it just me, or have you noticed how ridiculously low they're flying these days? Soon they'll be perching on our heads, their claws roaming through our scalps, their pigeon poo covering our clothes as they peck and peck and peck. They're coming to get us. They're coming to take the very food we eat from our hands. I've had an experience of just how truly deadly these pigeons can be. I've been scarred for life by these flying terrorists. Picture the scene. One bright summer's day, I was sprinting to my nan's house and going to the ice cream van. You know, the norm for an eight-year-old, the good life. As I ran past my nan's gate and other gates, I saw a group of pigeons. As I'm a courageous girl, I ran through those group of pigeons with ease. Big mistake. Those group of mafia gangster pigeons were plotting against me. So when I brought my ice cream, they were ready to attack. They flew around me, circling me, squawking insults in my face until I dropped my ice cream to the floor and then they pounced on it. Those cruel, greedy scavengers, I've been left traumatized ever since. Pigeons need to go. They need to pack up their filth and they need to go. We need to reclaim our streets. We need to be able to walk from A to B without feeling threatened and intimidated. But there is a problem. We can't shoot these vermin and we can't poison them as much as I'd like to. We need to be cleverer. We need to think about our environment. Have you noticed how litter is becoming a major problem? It's just scattered on our roads and these scavengers are feeding off of it. They're feeding off of chicken bones, chips, half-eaten sandwiches and crisps. They're dining out on us because we're too lazy to pick up our litter and put it in the bin. Maybe if we respected our streets more, maybe if we were more mindful of what we dropped, then maybe, just maybe, the pigeons would pack up and go. So don't empower the pigeon, keep our streets clean.